Hey guys, welcome back again. I said I'd put up a better video next time, so here I am. So I'm going to start off with um, these. These are my Sony headphones. I don't know the model number right off the top of my head, but you know, this is what I DJ with. You know, this is what I listen to. Um, great pair of headphones, love them. You know, can't ask for more. I'll put the model number. In the annotations down blue so all right first we're going to start with the f1 which is the basically it it controls the remix decks on the on tractor pro um you've got four rows of buttons here um four down four across and they're all loaded with samples in this case um i'll play a couple samples for you uh here we go good evening and get out that ghetto blaster and <laughs> house music all night long and i've got two pages worth of um samples here you can do samples one shots whatever you can even reverse stuff, which is fat. Um, let's see. There's a good one. Um, I'll crush you with my bare hands! And I like this one. One shall stand, one shall fall. So why is it got to be so damn tough? And that's kind of the basics of the um, F1. It controls the remix decks. In the middle here, I have my um, DJ Tech X10 USB mixer, two channel mixer. Um, let's see, uh, yeah, two channel mixer, USB. I've got my F1 and my X1 Mark II connected in the back, so I don't have to take up all my ports, my USB ports on my computer. Uh, you got a mic switch here, you got a talk over switch, basically. You got an EQ, um, kind of EQ. You got lows, highs, and this is the level for the booth. This is the gain knob for the for channel one. You got your another set of EQs, high, lows, mids, and highs for channel one. Another set of EQs for channel two, low, highs, mids, lows, gain. And here you have a master level, you have a balance, and for the headphones you have your pan, and you have a level button switch here. And basically you got your cues, and another cue button, you got your volume, volume, uh, cross faders. And you got a nice XLR for your microphone, which is a Samson. And let's see, you got some other features in the front that I'm not going to really go into. And now I'm going to go into the, the X1 Mark II. Uh, I'm sure you've probably seen this before, but what the hey. So you've got... Basically, what the X1 Mark II does is it controls two track decks and, and track the Pro 2. One side is here, one side is there. You got your cue points, whatever. Um, let's see. This is for loops, loading, shift does, you know, it assigns extra features to, you know, buttons. And here you have your your FX for champ for deck A. You've got your your FX for deck B or whatever. You've got your levels for your FX levels for for them for track for deck A. Then you have your levels for track B. I mean deck B. Your effects buttons, your effects buttons for there, and 
basically the way I operate my effects is that I hit the middle I put my finger in the middle here of the deck of the strip hit a button the effects not on it's kind of waiting in limbo so whenever I hit the strip you see the top light lit up that means it's on and that means that the operation so whenever I lift my finger off the effect goes off and basically that's my my setup <laughs> hope you enjoyed it excuse my cold and uh, peace out